Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to today's workout. It's a fusion class. We're gonna bring bar and pio into one. And so equipment is a mat, light weights, a small ball, a chair if you have it, or something stable. I have a bar back there that I'm gonna be using and that is it. If you haven't yet, make sure you do hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you do not miss any workouts. Let's warm it up. I'm gonna start with my feet open kind of in that second position, heels and toes, toes turned out. I'm gonna take the shoulders back. One more time, shoulder roll. All right, big inhale, reach those arms all the way up. Pull them to your back pockets and then reach back up, bring it down. Roll it up, inhale, reach up. Elbows to the back pockets, reach. Bring it arms in, now you're gonna bring your feet in, you're gonna squat, swing down. Reach up and again, elbows back pockets. Really kind of releasing as you come down and then lengthening as you come up. Good, you got a few more of these. And reach back, two more. Good, one more time here. Blast here. All right. Knees come up, reach it up. So a nice length in those arms. Pull the knee into the chest. And every time that knee comes up, try to take it up a little higher here. Three more, then sumo squat. Step out, sweep it down, reach up. Now when I'm here, right, I'm really gonna take my arms as low as I can and as far away from the body that I can. Get them nice and warm. All right, I'm gonna squat, step in here, and switch. So zip up your thighs and click your heels, because the magic is gonna happen. Ooh, two more. All right, stay in that sumo squat. Take a lunge in here, two, and lift up. Do it again. Stay and lift. Two more. Light hand on your thigh. Lunges, reaching for the foot. Reach, there we go. Really take it to the outside of your foot if you can. You don't have to touch the ground. A couple more. There we go. All right, you're gonna hold it to that right side. Two of these, and then you lift your leg. And you fly. You can have a light hand here. Two more. Shoulders roll them back. One more, please. Yeah. All right, reach for those feet. Touch. Good, come on, get there. Maybe the other arm reaches in opposition. You got eight more. Build that heat, you guys. Woo, inhale, reach it up. Dive it down. Half lift, release, relax. I want you to bend your right knee here. Bend your left knee. Drop into a ball. Step your feet back into plank. Down dog. Back to plank. Down dog. Plank. Do that a couple more times. Yeah, warm up those arms. Warm up those calves. Last time here. Hold plank. Knees down, child. All right, we are moving on. So I want you to take your body, flip it, I'm all alone. and I'm gonna grab my three pound weights here. I'm place this little ball into my inner thighs. Whoa, where'd your ball go? It can be a, a, can be a pillow. You got those weights? So I'm just gonna roll down halfway, and then come on up. As I'm there, I'm pressing into the ball, right arm reach away. Left arm. So you're gonna roll down and open up to the side. And as you're rolling down, you're gonna squeeze into that ball. Use your inner thighs, please. Just here, right side. Four and up, three. Switch sides, left side, reach away, pull in. Oh yeah, two more. You got it. Now both arms reach them out, and then see if you can hold those legs up. Bring those arms in, bring your elbows in. 
a little raise here, push. Now, while I'm here, I'm gonna press into that ball with my inner thighs. Woo. Come on. Oh, yes. Bring it up and in here. All right, release, legs up. I'm gonna open the chest and squeeze. Now, option, a little drop in the feet and then bring it in. Squeezing in those inner thighs. Two more. All right, I'm gonna reach that right arm, take it back here, and then the left arm. I'm keeping it straight. All right, now we're gonna bend those arms. Here's those triceps. Bend, extend, push your back into the mat. If you're getting a little tired in the legs, drop your feet. Yeah, keep this here. Now turn the pinkies in. Give me those skull crushers. Yes, and press into the ball. I don't need to move anything. I'm doing strength and still stillness in that lower part of my body here. You got four more of these. Get up, press in. Yeah, all right, now rock yourself up and bring your elbows down. Bring your feet up and just press into that ball for me. Ooh, couple more. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All right, we're gonna flip it. Get rid of the ball. Come on to all four. Yeah, your right arm is gonna have your weight. Let's row and reach. So an option is to have opposition happening here. So you can reach that other leg, opposite leg. All right, row, kick back here. Row, kick, come in and reach. Pull in. Now we can add some leg here. In. Woo. Reach. Good. A couple more. Bring it in, tap. All right, hold it out. Now, can you reach that leg and reach the arm for just a moment? Hand goes down, bent knee, lift it up, press. Shoulders relaxed. And an option if you want to take it for a level up, you could lift into beast here. Woo, get those arms to work a little bit more. All right, release for a moment. Relax those wrists. And we're gonna go to the other side. In four, three, two, reach that arm. Reach and pull. Set your posture for me. Now, extend the opposite leg. Pull your elbow up and back. We work the front, we're working the back side now. Four more, and then we can make it a combination here with the kick back. Reach first, and then kick it back. So here's my leg option. If it's too much, just work on the arm. Great job, just a couple more of these. Yeah, to clear your mind. You got your mind clear here. Two more, reach, kick back. One more time, kick back. Now, right there, hold. Can you reach an opposition here? You're fighting that gravity again. And then when you're ready to, place the weight down, bend your knee and then just start to lift the heel up. Option, lift the knee from the ground. Brace in that core for me. Woo, you don't need to. You can always take it down. You got eight more. Keep it rocking, come on. Four, three, two, and sit back for a moment. All right, let's finish this off. Give me that plank position, and then you can start to run the knees in, climb the mountain or keep it slow. It's a runaway song, come on. Pull it in to the end. Brace the core, push through your arms. Let's do seven, four. Woo, all right, relax. Hey, pull out your bar. I'm gonna be quick here because I'm gonna keep my music rolling. I got this fancy bar. All you need is a chair. You don't need anything fancy. 
Yeah. So we're going to turn on to your side. Turn one foot in. Your elbow's on the bar, or you could do your hand under grip. But open the hip up. I'm going to do an underhand grip. I feel like my ear is going to the bar here. And I'm going to have my hand on the hip. Little lift here. Lift. So open up through the front of your body. Eight more of these. So good to work on the side here. Reach this arm, bring the knee in here. Knee in, extend. Really lengthen out. Give me four more of these big reaches here. Yeah, less weight on that hand, more in the leg. All right, from there, now press it back, press back, a little forward, press back. So we're not moving very far here. I'm keeping my legs straight. You got four more. Just using the glute, the oblique here. I know, from there, I'm gonna turn down and little lift. So I'm gonna start to drop the shoulder a little bit here and open up the hip. So I'm getting right here on the top side. Four more. Now, bottom heel, lift and lower here. I lift, release, lift, release. As I keep the length in that leg, you can have both arms on your bar or your chair or underhand grip. Two more of these. Bending the knee, bend the knee here, bend the knee, and hold. Now from there, I'm just gonna start to circle that leg back, forward. So drawing a circle with the knee. All right, keep that leg bent last time here, just little lifts. Maybe your heel is lifted now. Of the standing leg. Yeah. Working on the outside of that hip here. Oh, yes. You ever do pretzel? Same area. Release, relax. Ooh, I need a little figure four. How about you? Give it a good stretch here. And then I'm gonna cross and lengthen. And then I'm gonna swing my bar over to the other side. Oh, yes. Find your position here. So either elbow or hand under grip. Turn the hip, open up the chest, lengthen your leg. Go as high as you feel that you can. Let's start to lift that leg. Lift. Ears down, shoulders pressed down. Great job here. Doesn't have to be big here. We got a lot of weight in those legs. Reach and pull here, bring it in. In and reach. Give me that length, please. Four more of these. Great job. We're going to be keeping that leg long and press it back. Push back. So I'm keeping it lifted, pointing that toe and pushing straight back. Like there's a wall back there. I'm trying to push it away. Yeah, keep it long, turn down, little lift. So I'm gonna reach a little bit to the corner, open up the hip here, staying all in this delicious place here, right? Four more. And then we're just gonna start to lift the heel up here. Lift it up. Lift, release. Lift, release. Up, release. I'm gonna have four more of these. Really roll onto your toes. All right, now bend your knee. Maybe you keep that heel lifted. And then when you're ready to, you're going to start to circle around. Take it slow. Oh, yeah. Just four more. Three, two, one. Hold it. Little lifts here. Lift. Relax your shoulders. Oh, can you give me eight more of these? Yeah, you can. Come on, pull up and in. Seven. Hold it up for a moment. And release. Woo! Oh, that felt good. I'm just a little, whoa. Give yourself a figure four stretch, please. And then you can do a nice crossover. Beautiful, beautiful. Let's grab that ball. Let's finish up in those inner thighs a little bit. 
hands falls like magic in those inner thighs and your pelvic floor and your core. So from there, get it up high and lift the heels up. Lift, lift. Release the shoulders. All right, keep some pressure in the inner thighs here. Keep your alignment, ears, shoulders, hips, heels, they're in line. Hold it up and the knees, we're sinking down here. Drop and lift. You can face your chair. You feel like you need a little more stabilization, but lift your toes, or sorry, lift your heels. So dig into your toes here. And then press into the ball as you come up. Whoa, yeah. I'm gonna turn here. Come up halfway. Little tuck. Tuck and squeeze. Heels lifted. Toes. Use them. They're smart. Come on. You got eight more. Seven. Six. Five. Right there is what we're using. Three, two, one. Now drop and pulse. You're going down, right? All I want you to do is hold and press in, press in, press in, in. Yeah. What you got in there? Press. Come on, burn it up. Relax your shoulders. Hold it, hold it, drop another inch. Zip it up, zip it up, zip it up. Three, two, one. Oh, my legs. Grab your light weights. Finish off with some arms real quick. Woo. So just three minutes in the arms here. Whoa, yeah. I want first position. Heels together, toes turn out. Roll your shoulders back. All you're gonna do is have a little bend in the knees, have your heels up, a little upright row. Row and reach. So you got a lot of foot on the floor, but just your heels are lifted here. Tempo up in the row, come on, up. So squeeze your heels so that you use your inner thighs a little bit here. Elbows up higher than your shoulders. There we go, four more. All right, take them up. Sink a little bit here. So you're gonna kind of bend those legs, reaching those arms up by your ears. Even higher. Keep the length. You can always drop your heels. Right on, all right. Take them out right here, hug it in. Hug it in. So now you have a bigger range. So you're gonna challenge your balance here. Open up, you can drop. Maybe zip all the way up. Hey, okay. try that. There we go. Now from here, pull it into your elbows, into your back pockets, and reach. You can zip up those legs. Send your arms nice and far. There we go. Four more. Oh yeah, get enough of this. That's right, now, take it in front, forward raise. Forward raise, and you sink. Two more of these, and then we're gonna drop, stop, and hold. Drop, stop, and hold. Hold, push. Maybe you open your arms up, palms up. Good, come on. Heels clicking here. Woo. Long arms here. You're gonna release your feet, taking the arms all the way up. Arms up, arms up, arms down. Ooh, yeah. Reach up. Reach down. Four more. And then we're gonna hinge a little bit front. Drop it into a row. Drop, little row. Let's go. Pull. Flat back here. My arms look like field goals. Now turn the palms the other direction. There we go. Four more. How about a little bit of a kickback? Palms push in, kick back, kick back. Because we're gonna be doing legs here in a moment. Let's just fire up those arms. Now palms up. Up, two, three. Lift high, high, higher. Lift, two, three. Hold. And relax. Woo! All right, you guys. 
Awesome job. Shake out those arms, clear your space. I'm gonna get myself all set for the Pio. Oh, so I thought it would be fun that we go into the lower body. Actually, I'll keep my mat this direction. Wide squat sumo position here. Yeah, are you ready for this? I'm ready for this. We got squat front attitude, squat to the back. We start with the heels lifted, sink on down. Let's pulse. Option with your arms here, right? I'm athletic, so I don't do any fancy arms. Sometimes I do. Squat front, then back. To the back. Sweep it up. So we get internal rotation, external rotation, whatever that means. Pull it in, take it to the back. Do it again. Squat pulse for three. And then front attitude. Three, two, lift front. Do it again. Now we lift to the back. Sweep it back. Three. Front attitude to the back. Attitude. Hold it here. Now lift. Your knee should be back. You can reach the arms. You can hold on to your chair. You can just pray. Because this is going to be so good for you. If we hit this once, we're hitting it again. Squat front. Squat back, hold. We lift it here, four, yeah, it's okay, front, back, you hold it, you ready to go to the transition, drop here, heels up, or you can do a little trickery of up and down, stay, oh, our legs are going to be on fire here, left leg, squat front, to the back. All right, so find where you need to be with this. You have funny positions, right? You can always do a kick in. That's option. Pulse three. Attitude front. Yeah, to the back. Lift it up. Turn that knee out in the front. Lift it. Hold it to the back. Now stay here. Find your balance. And that's okay to do this. Oh, you didn't fall on me, did you? Strength and stillness in that leg. Four more. Squat to the front. To the back and hold. Stay here. Four. To the back, all right, front, back and hold. Stay, you gotta laugh it off when you fall. Here we go, pulse it. All right, so again, you do some different things with the arms, but try to stay with your heels up. It's gonna challenge you in your balance, in your core, in your pelvic floor. Right leg, cut it down. Front to the back. One more. Three here. Take it to the front. Three squats. To the back you hold. Stay here for eight. Oh yeah, pull it back please. Squat front, to the back and you hold. Stay there for four more. You nailed it. Pulse here, heels up. Find it, dig your toes into the ground and then open up your chest if you can. You could be with some bigger arms here. If you wanna work them, I like that. How about you? Other leg, squat to the front. To the back. One more. Can you drop more in that squat? Right now, three pulses. Lift it up. To the back. You hold. Stay here. Eight. Don't let that knee come forward, girl. Come on. Take it back. Use that. Squat to the front. To the back. You hold. Stay there. Four. Yeah. Transition. Heels up. Yeah. Hey, anytime if you wanted to pick up some one pound weights, you could do that. Or not. I'm good with this. You ready for that leg? Last time is best one here. To the front, to the back. Do it again. Get low and 
drop it. Three of these squats, and then lift front. Squat pulse three, graceful lift, hold. Let's do eight. Squat to the front here, to the back you hold. Lift it up here. Four, three, two, let's pulse it. Yeah. Get a little sweaty hot now. Watch your body. It wants to do this, doesn't it? Pull it back. Get it up. That's right. Let's do it. Front. To the back. One more. You're squeezing that butt back there. Now squat three. Take it to the front. Squat three. Take it to the back. You hold it. You hold it. Four, three, two, one. Release. Woo. All right, what happened there? I don't know. My mind went for a trip. Stay in those pulses. <laughs> That's right. A little trippy today. Push the knees back. Can you hold your heels up? All that great stuff we've been working on here. We did a lot of outer hip stuff today. Hope you're feeling it. Four, three, two. Now just hold. Can your heels come up? Can you really dig into your toes? Can you really focus on me? Drop your seat just a moment, a little bit more, and push your knees to the back. Hold this for four, three, two. Reach out and sink. Ooh, yeah. Oh. Toka, toka. Bring that right foot forward. You're in low lunge here. And then just, when we have that opportunity, just really sink and stretch for this here. So hands inside, push this heel back. And you can always be up a little higher if you have a little less flexibility in those hips, that's a-okay. That front leg sweeps to single dog. Knee to nose, draw it in. Single dog. Pull and round forward. And then press and open up at the top. Two more. Use the breath. Exhale forward. Inhale front. Lunge and windmill. Left and right arm. And you're sinking in your lunge here. Open up through the front of your body. Add duck to the back. Sweep back here. Right ankle to the front. When you sweep back, keep your chest lifted and turn your feet as you move. One more time. Low lunge, settle down. Take it to single dog. Right leg, sweep it up. Knee to the nose. Single dog. Can you tuck it around even more here? Lunge front, windmill. Yeah. Adduct to the back, right angle, sweep it to the back, right angle, stay in the doubles. Low lunge, drop in your hips, relax your shoulders. Right leg, single dog, knee to nose, single dog, knee to nose, use your core. Lunge forward, windmill. Relax. Add up to the back. Sweep it. Right angle. Sweep it again. We're cutting down. Low lunge to single dog. Turn down hand stay. Reach up leg. Knee to the nose. Single dog. Lunge and windmill. Add up to the back. Right angle front. Low lunge. Stay there. Single dog. Right leg. Knee to the nose, single dog. Lunge and windmill. Add duck to the back. Nice job. Right angle, warrior one, push then pull. Pull back, straighten out. Push here. Pull in. Two more, use your breath, push them away. Last one, connect your squat. Drop and round. Atlas, reach up. 
round down, relax, and then give me that length. Two more. Last one. Side lunge, rear lunge, take it out, take it back. You can have a knee up, very athletic here. One more time, twisted low lunge, stay. Hands go down, open up that right arm to the back. Sink in your hips. Can you press your left arm through the floor? Head on the thigh, turn the back foot, warrior one, push and pull. Cut it down to twos. Connect your squat. Atlas, reach and push those hips. One more. Side lunge, rear lunge. One more in each direction. Stay here. Low lunge. Open up your right arm. Sink in your hips. Hand on the thigh, turn the back foot, push and pull. Squeeze between the shoulder blades. Connect your squat. Atlas, reach up. Squat again. Side lunge, get out there. Back lunge. Side. Hold it. Low lunge with a twist. Open up the right side. Push down to your left. We're cutting it down. Hand on the thigh. Warrior one, push and pull. Connect your squat. Atlas. Side and back lunge. Hold here. Low lunge. Twisted lunge. Hand on the thigh. Turn here. Warrior one, push. Connect your squat. Atlas. Lunge aside. Back. Stay here. Twisted lunge. Hands down, low lunge to single dog. Right leg up. Knee to the nose, round. Single dog. Lunge and windmill. Adduct to the back. Right angle. Warrior one, push and pull. Connect your squat. Atlas. Side lunge, back lunge. Hold that lunge. Twisted lunge. Oh, you did awesome. One more time through. Low lunge to single dog. Knee to nose. Lunge and windmill. Add duck to the back. Right angle. Warrior one push. Connect your squat. Atlas. Side and back lunge. Hold it. Twist it. Hands down, step back to plank. Hold. Ooh. If you need a drink of water, get it real quick. I'm gonna just stay right here. I'm going to my other side. Ooh. Oh, I love this flow. And I love this song. Here we go. So you got your left leg forward, right leg is back, and we're in that low lunge. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's go. Sink in that hip, relax your shoulders. Ooh. All right, cut it short. Leg to single dog, knee to the nose, pull it in. Single dog, knee tuck in and round. Lift up. Pull that knee to the nose. And single dog. One more time. Lunge windmill. Right arm, left arm. Sweep it back. Yeah. So you have the option of really moving as big as you want in that lunge. You can even just settle if you like. Add duck to the back. Sweep it here. Right angle to the front. Sweep it back. Keep your eyes lifted, chest open. Two more. Low lunge, cut it down. Single dog, left leg up, knee to the nose. Single dog, knee 
to nose. Lunge and at the windmill arms, right arm, left arm. Keep your feet open. Add duck to the back, sweep it. Right angle, sweep it back. Low lunge, stay in doubles please. Sink. Single dog, left leg up. Knee to the nose. Single dog. Knee to nose. Lunge it forward, come on, sweep it back. Ooh. Sink into that stretched back. Right angle, add duck to the back. Right angle, we're gonna cut it down. Low lunge to single dog. Left leg up. Knee to the nose. Single dog. Lunge and windmill. Right arm, left arm. Add duck to the back. Right angle. Low lunge to single dog. Leg up. Knee to the nose. Single dog. Lunge and windmill. Up and back. Add duck to the back. We're moving on. Right angle, warrior one, push, then pull. And pull. Bend your knee and straighten it out. Pinch between those shoulder blades. Open up the chest there. Connect your squat coming. Drop and round. Atlas, reach it up. Squat down, round. Lengthen and reach. Woo! One more time here. Side lunge, back lunge, knee option. Maybe you touch the floor by bending those legs even more. One more time. Settle to the back, hold it. Low lunge, twisted. Left arm opens up to the back and you sink in your hips. Can you push through that right arm? Give me a great twist here. Cut it down, hand left thigh, come up. Warrior one, push and pull, just two. Sink again. Connect your squat, drop and round. Atlas, reach it up. Connect your squat, reach up. Side lunge, back lunge. Settle in your lunge. Open to the back, left arm is up. Woo. Hand on the thigh, warrior one, push, stay in twos. Do that again. Connect your squat. Atlas, big reach. Connect your squat. I know you got more length than you. Side lunge, yeah. Back lunge. Side lunge. Hold that back lunge. Stay and twist. Now you know what's gonna happen. We're gonna cut it down to that single, hand on the thigh. Warrior one, push. Connect your squat. Atlas, side lunge, back lunge. Hold that lunge. Twist it. Hand on the thigh. Warrior one, push. Squat down. Atlas up. Side lunge, back lunge. Stay in that lunge. Twist it, everything you guys. Low lunge and then to single dog. Left leg up. Knee to nose. Single dog. Lunge windmill. Add duck to the back. Right angle. Warrior one, push. Connect your squat. Atlas, side lunge, back lunge. Hold it. Low lunge, single dog. Left leg up. Knee to nose. Single dog, yes you can. Lunge it forward, windmill. Add duck to the back. Woo. Right angle. Warrior one push, we're there. Hold it back. Connect your squat. Atlas. That's right, side lunge, back lunge. Hold it. Twist it. Hands down. Step back. 
knees down. Oh my gosh, super job. I'm gonna turn my mat. We're gonna stretch it out. Woo. So let's just do a nice smooth stretch here. How are we feeling though? You good, doing good? Did you enjoy all that combinations there? Woo. Come to all four. Round your back. And then release, look up. Do that one more time. Tuck that tailbone, curl under, hollow out. Inhale, look up. And then step the hands forward and let's go into a down dog. Hips up. Draw the abs in, drop the head, just relax here. You can walk your dog a little bit here. So alternating the heels, lifting and lowering. Shifting into those hips. Let's take that right leg into a single leg down dog. So lift it up and then bend the knee, flex the foot, open the hip out to the side. Press through the hands and push those hips up. Bring that knee forward for pigeon. Lift your chest up. And then sink. So releasing down to the ground. Let the forehead relax on the hands or the floor. We work the outer side of those hips just a lot today, huh? leg where it is, pull the back leg in, wrap it around for a little bit of a twist here, hand can go back, and let's just twist the other way, push into that knee, open up the chest, and then take that leg back, and we're going to go into plank, down dog. Left leg to single dog. Bend the knee, flex the foot, open the hip up. Drop your head. In through the nose and then out through the mouth, like an audible exhalation, like you hear the ocean. Knee forward in pigeon. Chest lifts. Shoulders drag down. And then releasing to the ground, hand on hand. Forehead can go onto the hands. And then pressing up, take the back leg, swing it around. So we got a nice little twist going to go on here. So you wrap around, lift the chest up, hand behind the hip, give it a good spinal twist. Good for your internal organs, like wring them out. Let's so wash it out. Turn it to the other side. So I'm going to place that elbow, my right elbow, into the knee, open up the chest a little bit more. Those legs are long in front. I'm gonna pull back one foot, either coming onto the elbow or you can roll into the foot. So you get not only the quad, but you get that ankle to kind of open up a little bit here. Relax the shoulders. And then let's switch that leg. So leg extends out in front. Pull the heel back and go to your level. So you can always stay on the side a little bit or you can kind of roll even more into that foot. All right, let's extend those both those legs out. Do a big inhale, reach up, 
lengthen up to the sky, and then shoot your body forward, lengthen, 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 and then when you're ready to, grab anywhere you can and release the head. And then we're gonna take it down. So bend the knees, start to round into the back here, releasing the spine, hug the knees into the chest. Drop the knees to the front, arms in T. And let's drop the knees to the back. And then we're just gonna extend the legs out nice and long. Ah, oh, take a deep breath here. Let's just relax in Shavasana. Sometimes it's good to just lie down flat, right? So I'm gonna leave you here, put on a chill song so you can just kind of relax. So if you need another minute or two or three, I'll just stay here with you. Oh, I wanna thank you. I hope you enjoyed the fusion class and you are being amazing to this body. This body is such an amazing thing, isn't it? I hope you enjoyed, take care of it, give it what it needs, listen to it. And I will see you next time on the mat. If you're staying here with me, just nice deep breaths in through the nose. And that audible exhale through the mouth. You could even place your left hand on your heart and your right hand on your belly. So you can feel the beating of your heart rise and the fall of your breath. time.